Hello guys, it's Ruben Triple Eight Seven here with yet another update video for my comp requirements. As you can see, I still have my treasure hunter and my daily left to do. So today we're gonna start off with my daily dungeoneering for the dungeoneering 120. And as you can see, I've passed 50 mil dungeoneer right now, and I'm slowly getting to that one. 20 but ultimately I want to get 115 first for the second batch of the Elven City All right guys all done with my daily dungeoneering and I still have to figure out where this guy is Oh there he, there she is Um, Right now I'm gonna be doing my herb lore run first because yeah herb runs is love herb runs is life basically and There's currently a seasonal high score that lasts for like one day Um. Well, it lasts for a week, but it's still one day remaining, and I'm in place 152 right now. So I'm I'm gonna try and get something to uh, get something done there to get the gardener title. So I'm gonna be doing my herb run real quick, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm all done with my herb run, and I quickly wanted to show you my herb run tab. On my potion tab, there is uh, also grimy herbs from my herb runs, just to make some. Uh, some extreme potions and overloads and there's also comp requirement uh, wishlist bones here and some slayer things but m the main thing on the this drops are my torstals which are 9.3k each my dwarf wheats who are 9.4k each and my lantadimes are 9.0 so i'm quickly gonna price check it just just for the funds and i'm gonna show you the pri price check real quick i mean this is pretty good from Herb Runs, is it? 83.5 mil in herbs on my bank right now. So I'm gonna be selling this just before the Bones XP weekend because people are gonna be buying them like crazy to make extremes and overloads and all that Gucci shit. And I'm gonna be stacking my Herb Runs till the 1st of November, so that's gonna be like a few weeks. So I expect to sell these um, herbs for 150 mil ish, and that's gonna be great for the real build. Um, what I'm gonna be doing now, I have an elite clue scroll on my bank, so I shall quickly do that. And I'm gonna show you the loots when I've done my elite clue. Alright guys, I'm back with my elite clue scroll reward. I don't know why, but the tile movement uh, sound is glitching, as you can hear. But this is gonna be the loots, and it's gonna be shit! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> why do I even do this? Like... <laughs> This is not even remotely funny, but I'm laughing. I don't know, but I love these 100k. Because this is probably 100k, and this is like one coin, and that's like one coin as well. So probably 100k. So uh, now I'm gonna be probably gonna do some Slayer. I have Celestial Dragons as a task, so you probably see me with whatever I'm doing next. So see you there. And guys, what is that on the floor right there with the beam? It is a hard clue. So yeah, I'm I'm not used to getting clue scrolls because my elite clue are used to be on my bank instead of me using them. But I'm not gonna pick up the hard clues. I'm only doing the elites right now. So that was a golden beam. Woohoo! All right, guys, and there we go again. Another hard clue. Again, no elite, no dragon rider or visages. No, not even essential uh, or ascension celestial grips. But we're almost done with the task, and I'll probably see what more run. Probably. Alright guys, all done with my Celestial Dragon task, and we made approximately 2.1 mil of the task. Now, uh, well, wait, if you get that out, 2 mil of the task with 236 Crimson Charms and 32 Blues, and now we're gonna get, hopefully, Dark Beast task for the comp requirement or some else. Let me check, we got Ice Strike Worms or Tormented Demons. We're gonna do Tormented Demons right here, because 70 Tormented Demons is amazing, and we have um, a Tormented Demon Slayer t card in my bank, so probably we'll get a drop of that task. It's not 100%, but it's an increased drop chance with that card. So I will see you at Tormented Demons. Alright, all done with the Tormented Demon task. Unfortunately, we didn't get any good loots, but right now we're gonna to get another task for Morven. I'm not using a Slayer VIP ticket this time, just why not? And I'm gonna kill 75 Glaciers right now. So hopefully we can get something good there, and I'll see you when I did that task. And what do we have here, guys? Second kill of the Glacier task. We pick up some Glaven Boots. I've never had these before. This is actually my first boot drop 
ever from Glacers. And they're 6.2 mil. I'm very happy with this. And yeah, I'm only two kills in. And I still have 73 more to go. So um, let's see if we can get anything else. And again on the same task, guys. Now we get Raid Fire Boots. I don't know what's happening, but this is the second boot in the same kill. And I'm actually gonna keep take these. It's uh, a bet with a real life friend of mine that if I would get Raid Fires, which would be nice with my outfit, I would keep take them. So that's the second boot of the Glacier task. And I actually need one more. So <laughs> it's pretty funny. Alright, we're all done with our glacier task and as you saw in the uh, clips before I got two of the special boot drops and I had a bet that I would keepsake the uh, rage fire boots and I just did that so I made over like 7 mil of uh, the whole task with the glavens they sold for 6.3 and then I bought a bond for 7.2 so I actually yeah, I lost 500k on the task, but it was a pretty, pretty lucky task. I, I actually never had boots before. So, um, I'm gonna get a new Slayer task real quick. And I'm gonna check what it is. It's gonna be Abyssal Demons. It's very nice to have Abyssal Demons. And I'm actually gonna stop recording now, because in 15 minutes while I'm recording this, the RuneFest stream is going, uh, is that, is going live with the... Um, the RuneScape 215 updates, so I want to tune in on that one and AFK some Slayer. So um, I think this was a pretty insane Slayer loot video. And um, if you enjoyed uh, yourself watching this video, please leave a like. It helped me out a lot. And I will see you again in the next video. See you later.